Hello there and welcome to Wireless Solutions. Today we are diving into the essential tips and tricks on how to fix Android phone not syncing contacts. In today's interconnected world, smartphones serve as indispensable tools for communication and productivity. Among their myriad functions, syncing contacts across devices plays a pivotal role in maintaining seamless communication and organizational efficiency. However, users of the smartphone may encounter challenges when contacts fail to sync effectively disrupting workflow and hindering collaborative efforts. Beyond connectivity, verifying and adjusting sync settings within the device system settings is crucial. Users can navigate through the intuitive interface of the phone to access accounts and sync options, ensuring that the sync feature for contacts is enabled and functioning correctly. This straightforward yet pivotal step ensures that contact information remains current and accessible across devices. If you are experiencing issues with your smartphone, not syncing contacts properly, here are some troubleshooting steps you can follow. Number 1. Check Internet Connection Ensure that your phone maintains a stable and reliable internet connection. Whether through a secure Wi-Fi network or robust mobile data service, this connectivity is crucial for the smooth operation of contact syncing, which relies on continuous access to the internet to update and retrieve contacts from your Google account or other synchronized services. A stable connection ensures that any changes made to your contacts on one device are promptly reflected across all synchronized devices, maintaining consistency and accessibility of contact information. Without a stable internet connection, the syncing process may be disrupted, leading to delays in updates or incomplete synchronization of contact details. Therefore, verifying and maintaining a strong internet connection is fundamental to ensuring seamless contact management and effective communication on your smartphone. Number 2. Verify Sync Settings Open Settings To access the settings on your phone, locate and tap on the Settings app icon, which is typically represented by a gear or cogwheel icon. This app serves as the control center for managing various aspects of your smartphone's configuration and preferences. Navigate to Accounts After opening the Settings app on your phone, put it in the search bar. Accounts and Sync or simply Accounts This section is where you manage all accounts linked to your device including Google accounts, email accounts, and other sync services. Tapping on Accounts and Sync or Accounts opens a submenu that displays a list of accounts currently added to your phone. From here, you can view and manage the synchronization settings for each account, such as contacts, calendars, and app data. Select Google account. If your contacts are synced with Google, tap on your Google account listed in the Accounts and Sync or Accounts section of your settings. This action directs you to a detailed view of your Google account settings, specifically focusing on synchronization options for various types of data, including contacts, emails, calendars, and more. Sync Contacts Ensure that the Sync Contacts option is enabled. If it is already enabled, try tapping it and on again to refresh the sync process. Number 3. Clear Cache and Data of Contacts app Go to Settings to access the detailed settings of your phone, Locate and tap on the Settings app icon, typically represented by a gear or cogwheel symbol, on your device home screen or in the app drawer. Apps Put on the search bar Apps or Application option. This will take you to a section where you can manage all the apps installed on your smartphone. Here, you can view details about each app, including their storage usage, permissions, and data usage. Find Contacts app Locate and tap on the Contacts app from the list of installed apps displayed under the Apps or Applications section. This action directs you to the detailed settings and information page specific to the Contacts app on your smartphone. Here, you can manage various aspects of the Contacts app, such as permissions, notifications, and storage usage. Clear Cache and Data Tap on Storage and then Clear Data. If the issue persists, tap on Clear Data. Note, this will remove locally stored contacts that are not synced. Number 4. Update Contacts app Play Store To access the Google Play Store on your phone, locate and tap on the Google Play Store app icon from your device home screen or app drawer. The Google Play Store serves as the official marketplace for Android apps, offering a vast array of applications, games, movies, books, and more. Search for Contacts Type Contacts into the search bar located at the top of the screen. Update if there is an update ready for the Contacts app, simply tap on the Update button to download and install the most recent version. This ensures you have the latest features and improvements for seamless contact management on your smartphone. Number 5. Restart your device 
sometimes a straightforward solution like restarting your device can effectively resolve temporary software glitches that might be causing issues with conduct syncing on your smartphone. To do this, press and hold the power button until the power menu appears on the screen. From there, select the reboot option to initiate a reboot of your device. This process refreshes the system and clears any temporary data or processes that may be hindering the proper syncing of your contacts. After restarting, check if the contact syncing issue persists, as this simple action often restores normal functionality without the need for more complex troubleshooting steps. Number 6. Factory Reset If all else fails and contact syncing is still not working, you may consider performing a factory reset on your phone. Before proceeding, ensure to back up important data as this will erase all data on your device. Back up. Navigate to the Settings menu on your smartphone and locate the search bar or scroll down to find the Backup and Restore option. Tap on it to access the backup settings where you can ensure that Backup My Data is toggled on. This feature allows your device to automatically backup your data, Wi-Fi passwords, and other settings to Google servers, ensuring you can restore them easily after a factory reset or when setting up a new device. In the Backup Account section within these settings, you have the option to select your preferred Google account for storing the backup data. This ensures that all backup information is securely saved to the cloud under your chosen Google account, making it accessible for future device setups for data restoration processes. By enabling Backup My Data and selecting your desired backup account, you proactively safeguard important information and settings on your phone. This precautionary step ensures that even if you perform a factory reset or switch to a new device, you can seamlessly restore your data and settings, minimizing disruption and preserving your personalized setup. It is an essential aspect of device management that enhances convenience and data security for users. Factory Reset To perform a factory reset on your phone, begin by accessing the Settings app from your device home screen. Once in Settings, you can either use the search function at the top or scroll down to locate the option labeled Factory Reset or Reset Options. Tap on this option to proceed. Before proceeding with a factory reset, it is crucial to understand that this action will permanently erase all data and settings on your device. Therefore, it is highly recommended to ensure that you have backups of important files and data. Have a backup plan in place where your files are securely stored on other accounts or devices, ensuring you won't lose essential information such as contacts, photos, videos, documents, and app data during the reset process. If you are now sure, just click Erase All My Data and then restart your phone. By following these steps, you should be able to troubleshoot and fix the issue of not syncing contacts effectively. If the problem persists, consider contacting the support team or your service provider for further assistance. And that is all there is. We hope that this meaningful solution brightens your day. And if you find this video helpful, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe. Your support means a lot to us. Thank you so much for watching and we hope to see you in our next video.